Listen to this jam, guys. This is some sweet music right here. I love the music in this game so far. Just the introduction music to the game is so, like, funky jazzy and stuff. But I'm definitely a big, fast beat techno type guy. Hello, fellow cyber sleuths. Is that what I would refer to you guys to as now? I don't know, whatever. Anyway, I'm Scootfish, and welcome back to Digimon World Cyber Sleuth. Oops, sorry, I did it again. Digimon Story Cyber Sleuth. Old timers call it world, what can I say? Anyway, let's get into it. Let's get down to it. I have something for you. I think that's the Kyoko thing I got going on. <laughs> your first duty to kick off your new career as a cyber sleuth. If Nakano is gonna be your base of operations, you should make the rounds and introduce yourself at the various establishments here. You'll be depending on these people a lot, so it's important they know who you are. Go. Hmm, oh yeah. Let me explain about the whiteboard. Hanging on the wall to the right of my desk is a whiteboard, you see it? You can accept cases from there. Field practice is better than book learning. I'll put some simple cases up on the whiteboard. Check it out and start working on some cases. Chapter 2. Alright. Let me still talk to her. First take a look at the whiteboard to the right of my desk. Alright. Over to the whiteboard then. Whiteboard. Case is received in the office. Click accept on the case to start investigating. Check details. Current status of the case from the player menu on your digivice. When you report that a case is over, you will be eligible for reward. You cannot carry on multiple investigations at the same time. When you take on another case during an investigation, please temporarily stop the investigation of your current case. Select an interrupted case. Report your blah, 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 blah. Okay, here we go. The things that matter. <laughs> so yeah, uh, colored magnet, red is urgent case, blue yellow is normal, purple is bonus case, green is digifarm case. And we do have all the DLC guys, so we should have all the bonus cases. Rewards for urgent cases marked with red are generally better. We should do those first. Alright. New cases were added. Purchase coffee beans at the K Cafe. If you find the place yourself, make sure you say hello to everyone. Alright, I'm gonna let you guys know now. Oh, seems like you were able to accept the case. It's pretty straightforward when you want to take a new case. Get one from the whiteboard, just like that. She interrupted me, I was gonna talk. <laughs> I'll add new cases every so often, so make sure to check it out from time to time. Check it. <clears throat> anyway, go on and start talking to people. I'm counting on you for my case, too. Alright, so I'm going to let you guys know. I've already been through this once. Well, not once. I've been through this because it didn't want to save. So, <laughs> I know exactly where to go. I'm trying to quicken this up. You can't walk between there? Come on. Good day, Cyber Sleuth. I don't remember what her voice is really like. <laughs> we'll work on it. We'll get the characters down. I thought it was about time you came by. Won't you come inside my little shop? There's something I have to do for you. We are bound by fate to do this. Hurry, please. Okay, then. Stick out your right hand. It'll be over soon. Hold still. Next is the other thing. Turn around. Don't move. Leave it all to me. All done. Ba -bam. 
I installed a special program into your CyberForm, adding some certain features. You can now scan physical things with your right glove and capture cyber data of the target. In other words, once things from the real world are in your hand, they can become cyber data and be brought to cyberspace with you. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Acquired data will be kept in your storage. Such a convenient world we live in today, don't you think? Modern technology and whatnot. What exactly are you? <laughs> I know a little more than most about the structure of the digital world, that's all. The lady has to be able to keep some secrets. But if you lose your way, come and see me. I shall be happy to point you in the right direction to the best of my ability. Use a connection jump to come directly to the Digilab from wherever you might be. Border between the dis uh, <coughs> blah, blah, blah. <laughs> The border between this world and the digital world is one is growing thinner. Digital one. Oh. Wow. <sighs> the proof of that lies in the fact that I was able to meet you in the real world. But that not, that might not be a good thing as far as the world is connect, concerned. <sighs> this is likely the harbinger of a far worse thing to come. <laughs> Meeting with you assures me of the light of hope that will shine for this world. <laughs> I wonder if I will enjoy this new world. Until we meet again in the Digilab. <clears throat> God. Fuck frog in my throat and shit. Cat got my tongue. Oh, there he is. There's the cat that's got my tongue. <laughs> Alright, off with we, what we gotta do here. Let's go into here. Now, you can buy Digimon medals from these, but from what we're gonna learn, I don't think it's worth it I think you can probably find them anyway we'll see it's not like these won't be here I don't know it really irks me like what if certain ones won't be available in here that were available you know what fuck it <laughs> I'm do what I did last time I'm getting different ones than I got last time too so I mean there could be ah, you guys will see if I go down here, it brings me back over here. Yeah, I'm definitely getting different ones. I haven't gotten Piximon once. Oh yeah, Nokia. Nokia! <coughs> Listen to this jam, guys. This is some sweet music right here. I love the music in this game so far. Just the introduction music to the game is so like funky jazzy and stuff. But I'm definitely a big fast beat techno type guy. Get out, right, girl? What a weird thing to ask. Very good question. It's 
Sorry, I had to clip it because I had to catch some of that music, guys. <laughs> The pits. I giggle every time I see that because I haven't heard that saying in a long time. <laughs> I don't know, I'm starting to like Nokia a little more. I thought she was just annoying as fuck at first, but fudge, fudge. <laughs> I've got to start cussing less, to be honest. Let's see. Nope. Oh, yeah, there's metal back here, though. So, second floor towards the bathrooms, there's a metal. Agumon Expert Metal. So, I'm pretty sure this one's the same every time. I think the ones you find in the world are the same every time. Smoking in the boys' room. Smoking in the girls' room. Don't you let my gender break no rules. <laughs> Wish there's more reason to talk to everybody. Bathroom again. Nothing on this one. Third floor didn't have anything. Oh shoot! Did second floor have one of these? I did that last time too. I don't think second floor has one. Drachmon. I don't have him either. All right. Fourth floor. All right. So when you go to the fourth floor, go to the back here. And this is where the... Well, I'll just let her explain. Presenting the Offline Coliseum. I'm your host, the Cutie Kitty Maid, Oruru. Is there anything you'd like to ask at Meow? A Meow? A Meow? I don't even... <laughs> uh, what's an Offline Coliseum? The Offline Coliseum is a place where tamers meet to test their strength. The Coliseum has six different competition levels. That's that's probably how she'd have that, huh? <laughs> Winning each cup gives you fabulous prizes. I guess I just sound gay most of the time I do the girl voices. There's a lot of girl characters in this. Okay, so after you're done talking to her and figuring that out, or which actually I guess you don't need to because I did it for you. You go back here, and in the back there's a little boy playing. And when you talk to him, he's like, ah, leave me alone. Stop, they're going to find me. Just take this and go away. And gives you a Toy Agumon medal. So, right back there. That little boy. Back in the game room there. She looks like... Any of you guys watch Digimon Try? I'm just saying. Alright, so... Hang on on that. I swear there was... Nope. Okay. So let's talk to this guy. Metal Man. Oh, are you here to give me a medal too? What kind of medals, you ask? Digimon medals, as if there was any other kind. Collecting Digimon medals is my dream. It's my life. It's my everything. That's why I'm known as the Metal Man. So... If you come across any Digimon medals, bring them to me and gladly buy them off you. These are collectible... Ah, these are collection items with various Digimon designs. You can obtain these in various places by selling them to the Metal Man. And by selling them to the Metal Man, you can get money and view them in the collection. Once you have one, try and sell it. So let's see what he offers me this time. So have you got any medals for me? Um, yeah. Huh, so it's a different price. I guess it's more about... Alright, we'll do this later. I don't want to waste time and not have the recording save. I can't believe you'd make this old man cry. Don't worry, I'll come back, old man. Alright, so in we go. This is our destination. 
All right, first you want to, there we go. Welcome. Welcome, please come in. Take any open seat. Yak yak things I say. You're Miss Kurumi's assistant? Kur Kurumi? <laughs> Kurame? Kurmies? Kuremies? Kuremies? Let's go with Kuremies. I think I like that better. I'm probably butchering that and I'm sorry guys <laughs> she hired an assistant wow so you get to be uh, so you get to bask in her radiant beauty to your heart's content whenever you want huh I'm so jealous it's outrageous truly outrageous boss yes what is it you don't look at me like that do you what Oh, you creep, you total perv. I quit. Right here and now. What, what? And I'm taking full payment for this month's salary. Plus, I'll be billing you for the 20 months of leering. You're paying me psychological damages. Oh, our customer. You wanted some coffee beans, right? These are the coffee beans Miss Kiyoka always buys. Here you are. Obtain select coffee beans. Hang on, Sak-chan. Quitting out of the blue like that kind of puts me in a bind. Does it now? Well then, shall we negotiate, boss? Negotiate? For what? Sorry, for four. What? <laughs> for what? Why? For my hourly rate, of course. If you're going to play stupid, I'll sue. We're talking a harassment lawsuit here. Yikes. They make quite the pair. Be that as it may, I've got the key. Blah, 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 beans Kyoko asked for. <laughs> Oi. Thank you very much. Come back anytime. That should be enough saying hi. Let's get back to the office. Investigation top quality beans complete. Report back to the detective agency. All right, well, back down we go. Uh, da, 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 this way? There we go. Much faster. Um, yeah, we talk. We gotta go back to the board to finish the mission. Done. Get your reward. 300 yen. That ain't squat. <laughs> From what I can tell. あいさつ周りは住んだようだな。かなり個性の強い面々だな。さすが中野に住まう人々と行ったところか。うん。さて、次は町に出てもらうぞ。反伝能隊の君が現実世界に完璧に溶け込めるかどうか。順のテストの最終段階といったところだ。新宿で聞き込みをしてきたの。君のことの噂になっているかもしれない。何せあの姿を目撃されたのだからな。その間私は私の仕事を片付けさせてもらう。また吉刑事にも調査結果を報告してお
これは人のことしての義務でもあるでは行動開始だ新宿へ向かいたまえ All right. Middle button to answer those, right? I need to get Digimon on the Digi Farm. I forgot about that. Yukino, I know you're. You plan to come over this weekend, but stay home and rest, okay? Is that my mother? Oh, I didn't even see I had anything from Nokia. Oh, and you can reply. How do I. How do I reply? If you recommend it that much, I'll give it a try. Okay. Interesting. You can reply to him. Told you don't worry about it. I got it. Sorry for worrying you. I'm feeling great. I can come over anytime. Got it. Sorry for worrying you. That's really interesting. Oh, I could reply to the... That's an older one, isn't it? I'm so... So, let's try using some phrase you learned from your friends and clients. Got it. Okay. That's... Ow. <laughs> That's interesting. Alright, so... Now I gotta hit the whiteboard. No? I just gotta go... Out and about. Hatch for Shinjuku. Okay, so I gotta go out to the map then. May not know everything, but getting out there and taking action is key. Don't think too hard, just keep moving forward. If you say so. Alright, guys. This is what I've been excited for. Oh, finally. Yes, go to the Digilab. I've got Digimon max leveled, actually, which I think is the better way to do it, because Digimon World 2, which I know I'm gonna, I'm referencing that a lot, guys, but that's the one I have the most experience with and plays the most like this so far. Because the other ones, and I see World 4, you are playing Digimon, and it's a sh uh, it's third-person shooter slasher. It's weird. And then World 3 is you only have select Digimon. World 1, you only have your Digimon that you have. And it's just, you know, World 2 plays like this. I think Data Squad suck too, if I remember right. So I need to go to Digibank. Now let me see. Digivolve and D Digivolve. Who is Max? Uh, am I able to... Does it say if he's Max? It doesn't say if he's Max. I know I've got Digivolutions possible. Hang on. Also, though, see, Alchemon, I didn't max the level out before I ended up digivolving into him, uh, Bottomons. So, if what I'm thinking is correct, then he's going to be weaker anyway. So, we're going to kind of use him as a variable and not wait till max to digivolve him. But I'm OCD about shit, so everyone else I am. <laughs> Alright, here we go. All right, so Terriermon, everyone knows who this is, so that's what we're going to go for first. If you don't, well, I'll let you be surprised. It's Gargomon! All right, so next is... We'll see if Siakamon even has any Digivolutions anyway. Nope, none possible. 15, 14, 14, 14. Man, if I would have got it one level higher. See who this guy goes to. Every Digivolution is possible. See, so that's Armadillamon, or Armadillamon, something like that. I'm not sure who that is. We had Terriermon, so I'm going to go for him next because... Go for the Digimon we know first, get him knocked out. I'm excited, like, I know there's so many Digimon in this one, and a lot of them I haven't had in other games, and the Digivolutions were kind of the same as World 2, but DNA Digivolving is different now, and, like, it's really cool. And there's Armor Digivolving.
All right, so we got him. Let's see who this guy's gonna do evolve into. Ooh. Okay, so Bodemon is gonna. See, I think that's Duramon is the name of that one. That's that little bear guy from I think Data Squad. And I don't know who that is. So let's go for Dorumon or whatever the name would be. Pretty cool, did you mind? I've exceeded my max party memory. Please reduce the memory use of the party. Wait, how? It's the same. Oh, they use different amounts of memory. Okay. Um. Only thing left to do is. Did you convert? Monty Man! I think that was actually a pretty good impression. <laughs> and he should come out going Puyo! Well, I think that's going to about do it for this episode, guys. Make sure if you enjoy what I do to like, comment, subscribe, you know, that YouTube stuff. And make sure to tune in next episode of Digimon Cyber Sleuth because we're going to be going out and exploring the map to see what the world's got to offer. you think I'd remember exactly what I'm doing everywhere. He was a jerk, if I remember right. <laughs>